Hey, we watched all weekend, and finally after midnight, it happened. Yeah, I saw this morning they came out with it. Debbie, last night we're, we were here at Lauren John's, and the funny thing about it, we looked like those younger kids because everybody was watching their phone, and we were all watching the same USDA farmer dot gov. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, but no, after midnight, um, you know the um, COVID. 19 food assistance program is open for business for the farmers. Uh, the website was updated. Uh, I checked it about five this morning. And so somewhere between about 1130 last night and five this morning, they opened it up. And as you can, as you can see here on the screen, the little red barn, uh, USDA is accepting applications now through August 28. And we covered that in another video about up through that time period. So what I want to do is just do a little quick intro to help everybody get to the right place. Uh, later on, we're going to go more in depth on another video. Uh, we'll be talking about farming. And, you know, uh, one thing I would say is, is Laura, you live on a farm, you grew up on a farm, you got, you got lucky. It was livestock. Debbie, you grew up on a farm and you have livestock. Sad thing. I think your first thing you and Tony, your husband talked about this morning was how many cows you sold during the period. So anyway, long story short, two <laughs> that they forgot about. But anyway, back back to, back to this. It's real important. Um, again, you're going to go through your farm service agency. And with that, there's several ways to get applications into them. But let's go on ahead. I want to slide through this because this website, if you don't watch, it's, it's very hard to navigate. So just moving on down. Uh, as, as I'm going to stop here in this area as we scroll down. And this one, we actually did an in-depth video, you can see below, uh, on what is a non-specialty crop, wool, livestock, dairy specialty crops. And also in another video uh, we will be producing later today is that also this website is updated in what is, el what is eligible, but for the first time ever, what is ineligible. And we're also going to show you how, if you believe your product is ineligible, you can apply. Let's move on down. I'm not going to spend a lot of time throughout the website. There's several updates or some updates and payment limitations. Uh, there's the ineligible commodity that I spoke of. And again, we're going to do uh, a, a separate video on both of those. Uh, we're trying to get you to, to the meat of what we need to be doing today. And here it is. Here's the, here's the news everybody's been waiting on how to apply. Uh, the thing about it is, is you can, uh, right now, uh, from the website, it says that the, uh, uh, FSA will be working with the agricultural producers by phone, by email, uh, and online tools. And they did add the online tool. They did add the calculator, um, last night. So here, right under how to apply, there is a phone number, 877-508-8364. Six, four. And then continuing on down the, the page, we now see how the CFAP application, you can click on right here and go out to the calculator. I've already been out on the calculator doing some calculations, you know, testing it out. Um, and uh, it, it's uh, an Excel spreadsheet. Uh, then on down next paragraph, you can download the application form, see it, hand fill it out if you want to. Also, there are separate hand calculation forms there. And uh, then if you have, if you run out of, of lines on the regular form, then you can get the continuation form. But just as a recap, what we've been waiting for, what we watched all weekend on our computers and our phones is finally out. So the thing about it is be sure and, you know, communicate, make your phone call if you haven't to your FSA location. If you're not sure um, how to contact your local FSA office, scroll on down to the bottom of that screen and there is a finder on there and it will give you your um, local phone number. And we can office. put that link in the description too so you can go straight to it from here. Yeah. So again, this is just a quick alert for all you that have been subscribing. We promised we'd be here um, this morning. So we're out in a matter of hours and we will continue to update over the next couple of days. Please subscribe. Hope to see you on the next video. Hope this helps. Hope this helps and thank you. Yeah.